Hi there. In today's video, we are going to talk about ways in which you use artificial intelligence on, on a daily basis. One of the ways that AI could be used is uh, for, for the purpose of making recommendations. Well, um, platforms such as Google, uh, Facebook, as well as Instagram, and many others have been using this type of technology to make uh, recommendations to their users. So let's say a company like YouTube, it has incorporated artificial intelligence in their system whereby it can provide you videos that you might like based on uh, the various uh, videos that you've been watching online, the, your, your search, as well as uh, some of the, the videos that you've liked and subscribed to channels that are related to your your personal interests so basically it it assesses between your likes and dislikes and gives you uh, an analyzed result or recommendation yeah uh, this is why you might find that some of these uh, videos are are actually very appropriate to you and uh, they look appealing. The second aspect that AI has been incorporated is uh, in in making predictions. Yeah. So right now, artificial intelligence has given us the capability of predicting what we we are about to to do. So applications that have have embraced uh, the 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 AI aspect of uh, predicting is Google Maps as well as uh, Google Measure. Well, Google Measure has been used in giving you an anticipated measurement of an item or an object just by the use of your camera as well as uh, the Google, Google Maps on the other hand has embraced AI technology for the predictive feature of giving you an anticipation of what to expect like how much time will you use to travel from location A to location B either using a vehicle or a motorcycle or you just walking on foot the other aspect that has been incorporated in AI is uh, the virtual assistance virtual assistance has been has been shown in aspects like Cortana in Microsoft. Google has their own which is called Google Assistant and uh, Apple Corporation also have their own which is called Siri. So what AI does in virtual assistants is do voice recognition. It actually can recognize your personal voice and uh, as well it could like analyze what you're saying, understand it and interpret it and give you expected results as per how you are commanding it to do actually what you're doing is just assuring commands to the system so ai analyzes the commands that you're giving and uh, gives you the anticipated results well i would really hate to end this video without trying to tell you what ai dies on your camera well for ai cameras on smartphones right now they do facial recognitions as well as color enhancement on your footages or pictures so you get quality images that are focused on the object or item or person that you're trying to take a picture or a video of and funnily enough it just gives you a blurred background yeah a blurry background for the items that you least need for your for your photo or your video footage so well now that's what you know how ai you have been interacting with it on a daily basis well if you think this is a good feature and it, sh it should be embraced more in other technologies so give it your comment and give this video a like subscribe to my channel as well and until we meet the next one thank you